Yo, what is up, everyone? It is Apple Cinema Reviews here. I'm doing my first video for you guys to basically go over a couple of things about the channel and what's going to be going on. So, I want to first talk about uh, the channel. Um, this is a community channel, and this channel lets you guys send in your video so it can be posted up on this channel to help you guys become more known. Um, this channel is going to be be run by me and my friend. Um, he's not here right now, but maybe in more in other videos you might got you guys might be able to. <sighs> Let me start that all over. <laughs> you guys might in in the future you guys might be able to see a review or something by him. Uh, so let's just get right into this video. Uh, this is my iPod. Um, it is in an OtterBox case, which is really awesome. You guys really need to go get one of them. Um, I have a plain lock screen right now for some strange reason. I don't know why. I had a, I had one on like a day ago, but I took it off for some strange reason. Uh, yeah, as you guys can see, I had that uh droid notification sound on which is really awesome um i have a animated weather widget on here htc which is really awesome yeah, it's really useful and stuff uh, as you guys can see it is 83 degrees in richmond uh yeah it's really good uh this background is uh i think it's called x xq site you guys go search that. I don't know what's the proper name for it, but uh, that's the background and like the uh, the um, the icons and stuff, which are animated, which is really cool. It animates basically every icon, which I really like. The Game Center, Safari, and stuff. Also, I have InfiniDoc on, which is really cool. I really like that. Also, um, I have this theme on. Show you guys it right now. It is called um, Spring Tomize. Um, really awesome. Um, this theme basically lets you customize a bunch of stuff. A bunch. Uh, one thing, cool things in it is this TV shutdown thing when you turn off when you click off your iPod it's like a TV thing when it goes off I'll show you right now check this out see pretty awesome right and then there you go again there's that uh, droid notification sound again which I really love my friends love it too it's pretty awesome you guys gotta go check that out it will be in cinema uh, Cydia which is really awesome but for today, I will be showing you guys how to get this animated weather widget, which is really awesome. So, first thing you want to do, go in Cydia. And <laughs> I already had everything open. It's going through a couple of stuff. But you want to go into search after everything is loaded up. You want to type in HT. Oh, my bad. HTC. And you want to type in weather, and you guys should see this one that says HTC Weather Animated, and it's gonna have uh, this page thing added. It might not show it for yours, but I mean, it might not show it for yours, or it might does. In mine, it doesn't show it, but it is there. Um, but you guys want to go to install right at the right hand corner. But mine says modify because I already have it installed. Pretty obvious. After you install it, you guys want to go back to your home page. Uh, everything is not going to be animated like this. You're not going to see the clouds or anything. Uh, it's not going to have your uh, area and stuff. To get this, you're going to go to iFile. If you don't have that, um, you guys might want to just go search in how to get it. Uh, I might do a video on how to get it, which is really simple. Uh, all you have to do is go into uh, Cydia and search an iFile and get it cracked 
uh, you are gonna have to add a source but I cannot tell you because I don't remember uh, but yeah so you want to go all the way back to the first folder thing and you want to go down to VAR click that you want to go down to mobile that and you want to go into library and you go, go down and you're gonna see this says per page HTML you want to click that you want to go down to that last one right there, last folder. Click that. You see this one that says configure me.js. You want to click that and you're going to go to view, view, uh, text view or something like that. Uh, hold on. I'll show you it right now. Hold on. I don't know if it's going to let me do it again. Maybe not, but yeah, you're going to go to the first thing that says text view. So when you're in this configure me.js, you're gonna see a bunch of writing and you wanna go down until you see this var loco lo local and uh this is not gonna say that right that that's not gonna say those uh numbers that is your uh area code um you guys wanna put in your area code for that it's not gonna uh your area code is not gonna be the numbers uh it doesn't work for that I don't think uh, but you might want to put in like a city a city one and you'll have like the codes and stuff and you want to put it right there where it says uh, var loco and you just want to backspace everything out and put it in and then after that uh, where it says oh, I want to zoom in for you guys where it says is Celsius uh, as you guys can see I have it as false it's gonna say true you might want to put it as false or if you want Celsius uh, as your degrees thing if you want it Celsius you could leave it as false I mean as true next to get the animation you guys want to go down here last thing where it says var show weather um, you want to change that to true and then you just go to you want to go to save and then done and then you guys can go back out and go to home and you just want to have your SB settings. Oh, my bad. Yeah, I have like this thing on. <laughs> you want to go to your SB settings and you want to go to respring. And then after your device resprings, everything should be completely set up and you should be good. So, yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope it helped out. Um, hope everything works if you have any problems just uh, leave a comment and I will get right back to you so um, yeah uh, also we will we should soon have a Twitter account up and um, you guys will be able to follow us on Twitter and we will uh, basically post up the latest updates and stuff on everything so yeah, that's this has been Apple Cinema Reviews. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks. Hey, sorry guys. Um, I forgot to guys. I forgot to tell you guys this. Um, if you don't know how to get your city code for the weather widget, so you get your area. You guys want to go to Safari, and you want to go to this website. You're just gonna type in www.weather.com, and it's gonna bring you here and you're gonna go to this bar right here and you're gonna I'm just gonna click on one for example let this quickly load do it again so you guys can see what I mean for, see uh see how I typed in Chesterfield um, it's just gonna give me the zip code for it but if you have like a city one like Richmond they have the same weather and if I go up to the top, you see how you have numbers and letters. And simply, you just want to go to that. My oh, bad. Oh, it's getting blurry. You just want to select that. And you just want to copy it. And then you just want to go back to iFile and paste it in the zip code spot where I, to where I told you guys last time. So, sorry about the mistake. Uh, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Peace.